Hello friends, in this video tutorial, we will see the concept of web services task. So for this, I have dragged the web service task to our package. Now, in our web service task, we have to first of all provide the HTTP connection. So now, HTTP connection is provided with the help of providing a path to the WSDL file. That is, the AMA ASMX file is the web service file. Then there is a question mark and then there is the WSDL keyword. So this actually points to our web service. So let us test this. So connection has succeeded. Okay. So this is how we have provided the HTTP connection. Now the WSDL file we have saved over here. Okay. In our folder. Now I have set the over overwrite WSDL file attribute to true. Then in input, it shows the, we can select the method and the service, okay. So service is temp convert, that is temperature convert and method is Celsius to Fahrenheit. And then output, we have to just specify a file connection, okay. In this file connection, I have specified uh, SSIS to create a file and it will be at this particular location. Now, once the output file has been specified, SSIS will create the XML file for whatever response is received from the web service into this XML file. So now once everything is configured, let us execute our task. So right now in our folder, there is only WSDL file. So, let us execute this task. So task has executed. So we can see that now the external file is generated. So we can see that as we have provided the input of 37 as Celsius, it has converted the output to 98.6 as Fahrenheit. So friends, I hope that this video tutorial on how to use web service task is useful to you. Thank you.